Cristiano, I don't think I've ever heard a former player come back and get such a good reception. Was that quite emotional for you at the start? Uh, it's, it was unbelievable. Um, it was an emotional moment for me, for the both games, uh, especially tonight. It was uh, unbelievable. I, I don't have words to explain what, what I feel. I just have one word uh, to say, it's unbelievable. Did it make it hard to play against Manchester make United me, after the way me, the fans had behaved? What the supporters may do it with me uh, make me feel <laughs> shy because, in my opinion, in the both games I didn't play uh, like my like I, I play all the time, a good level. But anyway, uh, I helped my team, you know, to score one goal in home and one away. I helped my team. I feel a little uh, happy inside because you know Madrid go through. But in the other hand, I feel a little bit sad because you know uh, Manchester United deserve. But it's, uh, it's part of the football. I, I support uh, and I, I am with the white collar, so it's, it's, it's the, these feelings that stay in, the, in this stadium, Theater of the Dreams. How much sympathy do you have for your fellow Portuguese Nani for, for that decision? Well, to be honest, I didn't see the replay of the, um, what the Nani do, uh, did, but uh, it's situations that happen in the football. Uh, I'm not gonna gonna say more nothing because I didn't saw the replay. Given the reception that you had, might we see you back here at Old Trafford again sometime in the future? <laughs> well, in the future we never know. But the, the, the supporters here and the club, it's it's massive. The future never know. But in this moment, I'm very I'm very happy in Real Madrid, and uh, I want I want to be there.